Hi, my name is Stephanie Rosenblatt, and I'm one of the librarians that works here at Cerritos College. Ms. Estrada asked me to put this quick video together for you so that you'll know about the resources our library offers you as students here at the college, and also so you'll know how to get help six days a week from a person. So we'll start on the college's homepage, which you'll see right here. If you click on the quick links, you can scroll down and see where it says library and chat. If you forget everything else about today except the location of this little link here on the right, that will be fine with me. This is our link where you can chat with a librarian. When you click that link, you're going to be able to communicate with a live human being Monday through Thursday from 7.30 in the morning until 10 at night, Friday from 7.30 till 3, Saturday from 10 to 3. So if you have questions about the library or the college, you can ask them here. Now, what resources does the library have for you? Aside from expert help, which you can get in person right now, Monday through Thursday from 9 to 6, um, which is also when the computer lab is open, we have a lot of resources that you can access online. One of the things that's really popular with students are textbooks that are on reserve. So let's say you're taking an algebra class and you know the name of your textbook. You can look for it under course reserves. Um, you can look at the record, which is the information about the book, to see how many copies are available. And you can sign in using your credentials, the same thing that you use to sign into Canvas to reserve the book. Um, if you reserve the book, you'll be able to pick it up at the library using one of our lockers. And there's information about that here. It shows you where the lockers are located and how you can pick them up. You can also borrow um, laptops or hotspots from the library using this application form right here. We have a lot of other things in our library catalog other than textbooks. So let's say if you were um, doing a research project on homelessness. When you're in the catalog, you're going to see all kinds of things that we have, resources you can use. If you're not going to be able to come to campus, you can click this button that says available online and it'll limit to only things that are online. You can also limit to different types of resources, such as books. And if it's available online, when you click the link, it'll take you to where you can look at it, right? In a different, it'll take you to the database where the book lives. And you'll be asked to log in using the same credentials you use to log into Canvas. And if it's a physical book, when you click here, it'll tell you whether the book has been checked out or not, right? So it's available, it's in the stacks. Right now, we're getting the books for you, so you would come to the library, we would grab it, or just like with a textbook, you can sign in and reserve it. Um, and then you could pick it up in the locker um, later that day or the next day. Another resource that is really great for students is our research databases. So we have, you know, over 50 databases here, which are just collections of information. This is where you would find articles. Also, you know, collections of reference books. A very popular database is Academic Search Complete. It's kind of like the super Walmart of databases. It has a little bit of everything in it. And so if I did the same search in here, And I could do it and, let's say, Los Angeles. Right, so I'm doing a search where I'm looking for homeless, anything about homeless and Los Angeles in the same article. Right, so I have a thousand, over a thousand articles. I can limit. 
um, first thing I would limit to would be full text because I only want to know about articles that I could read, not things that the library doesn't own. You might need to limit to peer reviewed if that's what your professor wants. Um, if you see an article that looks interesting, you can read the abstract, which is the summary. And if you like the article, you can click on the link. And if you look over on the right hand side, it'll show you how you can get to the full text or save the article. So this one is available in HTML. I could listen to it if I didn't feel like reading it. Um, I could save it to Google Drive. I could print it. I could email it to myself. And then the best part is if you need a citation, if you click here, this little cite button, it'll show you cit the citation for the article in different citation styles depending on what's required for your class. We also have something called research guides. So if you're not sure which resource to use, um, you can kind of go through here. And so let's say controversial issues. If you were going to write a paper about um, animal rights, for example, and you didn't know where to start, this guide here would break down the research process by giving you um, sources you could use to understand your topic better and recommending them. You know, it helping you find books by giving you some of the subject terms or even recommending certain books that you might want to look at. Identifying resources you could use to find articles on your topic. Um, also, you know, recommending some streaming videos on the topic, but there's even more in this data page called Canopy. And then also sending you out to different sources, oops, that one's broken, um, that you can use to um, cite your paper. So even if you don't remember anything else about what we just did, if you just remember that you can get to the Cerritos College Library from the college's homepage by clicking on the quick links button and that you can get help whenever um, or between 10 and um, between 7.30 and 10 most days by clicking this link here or that you can walk into the library and get help at this time. If you just remember that from today, that's all you need to know. Just know that the librarians here at Cerritos College are here to help you. And I wish you good luck um, and welcome to Cerritos College.